people. I bet it's pretty nippy indeed out there. And nippy is definitely is, uh, if I wasn't wearing this jacket, I would definitely be shivering. Um, and I wouldn't be the only one, as certain Dothan workers are definitely working late into the night tonight. With the temperature dropping so suddenly, many Dothan residents are facing new troubles. Contractors working on the Beaver Creek Sewer Rehabilitation Project may face the worst of it, as they will be working till about midnight where temperatures are supposed to be in the low 40s. I mean, I, I like the temperature drop, but uh, it's just cold. It's and just you know, cold? Yeah, you bump your fingers, your hands, and feel like you smash it with a hammer, so. While moving large sections of pipe, while moving large sections of pipe across Honeysuckle Road, the workers say they try to just bundle up as they keep working on the temporarily closed road. And with people trying to stay warm in their homes, heaters that haven't been used since earlier in the year are causing problems for some people. At close to 8 a.m. Wednesday morning, a Dothan resident turned on his heater and smoke began billowing out. He immediately called the fire department to his apartment complex. The house is like 59 degrees this morning, so we, we had to have the heat on. Um, that's Especially we got my mother-in-law, she's, she's older and she needs, needs to be warm too. But me, I really don't care. I can go around all day with shorts and t-shirt. Luckily, no serious damage occurred. HVAC services like Southern Cooling have also had their work cut out for them. They've been responding to a number of no heat calls as well as people reporting the smell of smoke coming from their heaters after being dormant for so long. We recommend that folks actually have a maintenance plan in place where we come out and check the system. And uh, we do that before it really hits hard cold snap. And then we'll uh, make sure that we fire off the heat strips and, and burn all that debris off of there. So then they don't have to worry about it. We're right there, we're checking it out and we're making sure that everything is good, that there are no bad electrical connections or any kind of a short that it's they have to- It's 45 degrees out right now and only getting colder tonight. So if you're not already bundled up, I definitely recommend it. Back to you, Mike. All right, Adam. Yes, indeed. I think you need to get back into the station and start warming up.